What is going on YouTube? Floopy Donkey here and uh, just got a real quick video for you on how to tame the boar. So you've probably been traveling early on in the game and you see the little, you know, like hedges or stones or whatever that tell you about different things inside the game. And you've seen one that talk about the boar and how you can tame them. And uh, I finally figured out how to do it. Basically, you just build a pin here with your building tool. So you have the round pole fence here that you can use. I mean, you guess you could really use any of these things, but obviously it makes more sense to use this. And what you do is you go and get the boar to aggro on you. And I had some around here. Here's some right there. And you just get them to come in the, into the fence, and then you just place it down, plop it down. So we're going to do that right quick. I'll show you how it's done. It's super, super simple. I think I had a, I think it was three over here, but let's get this one too. We'll do... We'll knock out all three while we can. And, uh, you know, if they hit you a few times, you're, you're, even if you are early in the game, you're, you're still going to be able to survive. Obviously, this probably isn't something that, you know, you want to prioritize early in the game. And I've got some monsters over there, so let's do this pretty quickly. But uh, you're just going to kite yourself right in here, get all three to hopefully get in. We'll just do him. And then you'll just plop it down, just like I did. Uh, let's destroy this. See if we can't get them in there. And boom, there we go. Now we've got all three pigs, piglets, piggies in here. And obviously you could do a lot better of trying to uh, keep things safe and secure. Now you see they are trying to get out. So you'll have to do your best to uh, repair as you go along. But they shouldn't, they shouldn't do too much damage against this stuff. Uh, but if you see them doing damage, of course, you will, uh, you'll just... Go around, repair it with your repair tool, and you'll be good to go. Now, one of the things that you're probably asking is how do you feed these guys? Because you actually need to feed them. And all you have to do is actually throw in your uh, your mushrooms. You see, he just ate that. Throw in mushrooms, throw in... Uh, and you see a heart just came up there too, meaning that they're slowly taming. They're slowly falling in love with you, so to speak. And you'll just keep doing that. You'll keep throwing them food. And hopefully, over time, that that uh, yellow heart will actually change color. And once it changes color, I can't believe if it's white or red. If somebody knows, please let me know in the comments. Uh, you can get them to tame. And I don't know if I can get them to tame here in this video. But that's pretty much all you got to do. Uh, just make a quick little short video. Like I said, the biggest thing, obviously, was having enough food to... And you see, it just went green. So um, to tame so that they have enough to eat. And once they tame out, you'll see the heart will actually change colors and all their food will be gone, obviously, and you'll be good to go. But the biggest thing, obviously, to remember is just repair your, your walls. And after they tame, they'll no longer be trying to kill you. <laughs> and then you can uh, you can breed and, and do all that good stuff. But uh, if you have any questions about anything, leave down in the comment. Um, also stream this game on Facebook if you're interested. Hopefully that helps you guys. And you can pretty much do this with any animal that you can tame. So I'll catch you later. Loopy out.